All right, this is Martin with Ask Audio, and I'm back here with uh, one of my favorite things from the show. This is Vinyl Cutter. So I wanted to ask you guys a little bit about this because um, coming from my background as a DJ, I've always wanted to be able to cut my own vinyl. And through the years, I've looked at a lot of solutions like acetate presses, uh, different vinyl cutters, but this one's really neat. I mean, you put it over your Technique 1200, it cuts, and it looks like it's actually vacuuming up all the uh, leftover vinyl. So tell us a little bit about how this process works. How the process works very well simple. We take the computer, take the sound from the computer, we can take every source and we go to this small electronic, goes in cutter head, and the cutter head cuts out the groove of, out of a blank record without groove. What you see here is the outcast groove already. So that's all. It's a machine was invented by Edison and we continue a little bit this way. Very cool. Um, uh, one big question that I have is how much are the blank vinyl discs? The black vinyl discs are $2.50, one, 120 grams and we have also 180 grams. We have each, each dimension, 7 inch, 10 inch, even 8 inch. We have also it's possible to cut uh, master plates for plastic factory, everything is possible with this machine. The price of the machine is about $4,000. Okay, interesting. So, how would the resolution of this compare to an actual pressed vinyl record, as far as sound quality and loudness goes? The quality is as good as press record, maybe even better, because there are not the noise of the pressing process on it because this is really directly done. Okay. Each record in Plastic Factory, the first record, always is done like this with such a machine. Interesting. So I guess the uh, big question, the one big question everyone wants to know is, what does it cost to get one of these? Uh, the machine costs about $4,000, so it is not less, but also not so much if you think how much uh, money people waste in other things. So it is a, would be a good investment. I mean, $4,000, looking at the cost of acetate presses and other solutions on the market, $4,000 to me seems really reasonable. In fact, I think I'm going to just buy one of these. I mean, until the day when we can actually 3D print records, you know, when the resolution gets good enough for that, this is the solution. And I'm really stoked to see this. So thank you for bringing this to market. Thank you very much. Cheers. Thanks, guys.